Hey guys, happy blessed Sunday to you. Wanted to take a minute for you to say hello. Hey guys, happy blessed Sunday to you. Wanted to take a minute to say hello again as uh, it feeds my soul actually as much as it does from what I read it does yours. So uh, much appreciated for that beautiful healing every every week that you bring me. Um, I'm here at home, just wanted to take a, a minute to say I've made a, another homemade iPhone, iPad video for you. I, I mentioned a while ago um, that I'd written like a lullaby or something. And I, I guess it's a song, but it, a lullaby in the sense that it was written entirely for 
comfort, to bring comfort and reminder of like, God's light in his Sunday post, so it's a song. But I wanted to keep it hip and, 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 and groovy if possible. <laughs> um, and it also recognizes the story of someone who has walked through challenges, has walked through the adversities of life and decided to stay close to their, their heart, the heart that they were given at birth before the manipulations of life, the manipulations and the tribulations of life. Um, and the beautiful joys and the wonderful challenges that come together as you get older, I think, as somewhat to maybe a, a younger mind or somebody that hasn't seen it yet as a naive statement or a cliche or whatever, but they are lessons, you know, they're lessons of change, lessons of what's valuable. For example, I always say to people, my friends, you know, when we lose somebody, it feels so painful. If somebody's rude to us, it feels painful. But one is an intense love. And it's good to distinguish between the two, isn't it? You know, love is sometimes so agonizing when we no longer can love those we lose to the next transitionary phase of life. Um, and not really death. I think, I think that's how I see things, you know. But I, I feel that this song was needed because it brings comfort to those that have faith, want faith, <laughs> maybe even want to transcend the judgments of those near them, thinking if their faith showed up, that they themselves would be judged. And, and you know, the irony of that, you know, is that it says very clearly, doesn't it, you know, no judgment, it's not, it's not welcome in any book of, of any spiritual form, the Bible or any other, it doesn't welcome judgment, yet. One of our favorite things to do as human beings, unfortunately. And it's hidden in fear. It's hidden in the inability to understand somebody. You know, somebody that said, okay, I'm going to quit my job. I'm going to do this. I'm going to go and do this, blah, blah, blah. You think to yourself, okay, this may be crazy for, for you. But for them, a courageous act fighting for their self. I'm not saying that that's what everyone can do because of the commitments, the responsibilities. But we must, I think, honor courage and those that are trying to bring light to the world this community is typical of that it's a beautiful beautiful catalyst this song somebody actually said to me um why are you doing your songs why are you giving them to instagram i'm not, I'm not giving them anything i'm giving them my love and appreciation and after all their demos on my computer at home and their videos on on an iphone and an ipad with the help of you know two of my dearest buddies um and they're still going to be recorded in the studio I'm still going to go play and make a real video with, you know, grown up filmmaker toys that I would like to use, you know, good glass, big lenses. But this is my way of saying, hey, you know, thank you. You gave me great reason every week to try to find comfort here. But also I found and searched for that for myself that was truthful within and shared it. And then we find this community that's like minded. For me, it really does reference whoever is the co contributors here of this community. It, it does tell me that it can't end here, can it? It can't end in this community. It, we just must be, collectively, we must be an example of what's out there, you know? So it's extremely inspiring. I don't know what percentage we are, but we clearly exist. And that to me is, that's fantastic. Um, oh, I've also recorded the song I played on the on my, living room floor last week I demoed it on my computer so I'm gonna do a video for it next week it, it came out it came out, came out okay you know so I'll do another film another little short video um, again encouraging walking as one and this one is don't be afraid this song today which I'm gonna share with you right now um, I think we've all been in those points in our life when we have felt fear standing alone sometimes not even understood by those closest to us but i think faith when we were kids was not a bad word i think when we were children faith never felt so uh, uncomfortable words relating to our faith never felt so uncomfortable but it really does give comfort when one needs to know they're not alone and it's not for me it's not like oh better to be with faith than be alone that's a good start i think <laughs> For me, it's a way of life, and it's also a way of saying, look, on these Sundays, I just, I just want to be somebody outside of all the things I do professionally to not let faith become 
detoxified by what is right, wrong, appropriate, inappropriate, whatever. No, no, no. Faith rises above all of those noises. I think faith stands in, in a good place that we should all feel comfortable with. Um, you know, slow the wheels. <laughs> know that there's something bigger than us, something greater than us, and, more, and something that we are responsible uh, responsible towards our actions and what we say to the God to which we pray. It means we must sort of police ourselves and monitor the way we walk. And I think that's not a terrible thing, you know. So this song is to put my arms around you virtually if I could and say, hey, you know, this is, it's right there always, the support you need. So this, is, this song is called Don't Be Afraid on a, on a Sunday that I hope blesses you with love and uh, support and uh, happiness and health. So have a beautiful day. As always, my, my, the thing I always ask, please carry it to the week ahead. And uh, don't worry about judgment as much as your integrity of self and who you know you are. Um, because I thank you personally for being here and contributing to this community. God bless you. Have a, have a great day. This is uh, Don't Be Afraid. I hope you enjoy it.